hey guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl tupo if you're new here welcome 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 please subscribe like comment give me a thumbs up guys today i'm going to be showing you this easy rubber band jumbo braids so if you guys want to see how i achieve this look please continue watching Okay guys, I'm going to be using this super TZ 60 inch expression hair. It comes three in a pack. I'm using two and a half packs for this guys. And I'm using shine and jam, rat tail comb, as well as some rubber bands to achieve this look. My hair is already washed and moisturized. I pre-stretched my hair, you know, the night before, so it's nice and manageable. So I'm just gonna show you guys how I section my hair. I just go straight from ear to ear. I usually use the shine and jam when I'm sectioning my hair just to make sure it's really nice and straight, you know, the parts are really nice and crisp. And then I take the rubber band and just secure the hair with it when I'm like sectioning, okay? So the little parts that I'm making, I take the rubber bands and then just um, hold it with it. I'm going to have like a separate video of me sectioning my whole head um, because I didn't want this video to be too long, guys. And I'm just using these rubber bands just to hold the hair, guys, okay? Somebody was asking me actually when I did my Senegalese um, rubber band um, tutorial if the if this technique works with um, box braids as well. So I was like, yes, sis, it does. And I was like, okay, let me show you guys because it really does work. I've, I've rocked this before and um, I love them. So I'm just going to show you guys again like how I section. I try to feel where the first line was, like the first section was, and then I go on the side, guys, because I just like them like that. I don't like them straight together. That's just me. That's just my preference, but um, you can do them anyhow. These rubber bands, guys, I'm just securing with. I'm going to be taking them out when I am doing this style, guys, okay? Like these are just to secure the pieces like sections this is how we're doing this is the first one i just wanted to show you you're going to add some shine and jam on the hair on your natural hair you're going to part it in two you're going to take the expression hair place it on the middle and use a rubber band to secure it okay so when you place the rubber band, you know, just make sure you pull it a little bit, give it a tug so it's nice and, you know, a little tight, not too, too tight, but you want it to be nice and snug. The reason why I like to do this technique, guys, it doesn't put tension on your hair. So this technique is very secure, very, very secure, and you do not have to pull out the rubber band when you braid. Somebody was asking me if they have to cut the rubber band when they pull it in, like when they start braiding. No, you do not. This is the easiest method of braiding you have ever seen. Like anybody can achieve this. And then you are going to take one of the pieces. So you have like two strands, right? So you're going to take a little bit from both sides, a little bit from the first strand and then a the little bit from the other strand. So the whole point is, you know, making this into three equal parts, okay? And then you're taking your natural hair, you're placing it in the middle of the hair that you just made. And you take a little bit of the shine and jam and you know, just add that to both your hair and your expression hair. So just like that, you start braiding down. You just braid it down, you know, just like a normal braid and it's very secure. Just make sure when you're braiding, you don't braid it loose on the bottom. Okay, guys, you have to like tag it on a little bit and the rubber band is not going to show. Trust me. I like to go under, I know, I know some people go, um, on top like on their braid pattern that's still okay but i like to go under because i feel like it lays better when you go under i don't know but that's that's how that's just how i braid and um you know just making sure you're braiding and going all the way to the bottom i still tie a knot at the end i'm just used to it i feel like um it's secure because i don't want to finish and then i still have some that have unraveled you know what i'm saying so just just for your security okay just so you don't work twice just make sure you tie the little knot at the bottom and that's it. If 
you don't know how to grab from the roots, this is your technique right here, guys. This braiding technique is like, what? What, sis? All right, guys, so I'm going to show you in a slow motion how to braid. It's just like a normal braid, just like you braiding your own hair. So it's nothing fancy, nothing serious, you know, just like braiding down. That's all, that's all it is to it. So, yeah, so it's very, very easy, very beginner friendly. Oh, my gosh, like, I am very excited about this style, guys. I'm just like, yo, sis, come through with the easy tutorials, okay? <laughs> So I'm going to show you guys again, you know, I'm taking my detangler. If you need to brush it again, I'm just showing you, um, add a little bit of shine and jam and part the hair in the middle. I parted a little bit of my edges out cause I wanted to, um, do some baby hairs later. So this is the same technique guys, place the hair in the middle and take a rubber band, tie the hair, give it a little tug. Okay. So it's nice and secure and um don't don't tie it too tight so it hurts you or whatever but just make sure it's really nice and snug okay this method protects your hair your hair is not like too stressed so this technique guys i love 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 If you don't know how to grab from the roots, as I was saying, this is the perfect technique that you can do, guys. This technique works so, so good. And let me tell you, these braids are as secure as any braids that you can get. Like, for real. For real. For real, for real. For real, for real. Okay? For real, for real. For real, for real. <laughs> I'm showing you the front as well, you know, add a little bit of the shine and gem. Shine and gem is my bestie at this point, guys. Like, okay, so somebody was asking me, if you don't have any shine and gem, can you use any gel? So yeah, you can use any gel. I just feel like the shine and gem makes it look more crisp, you know? You can use any type of gel, I feel like. But I just love the um, shine and gem. I'm showing you again parting the hair on each side mixing it with your natural hair that's that part that you did and then just start braiding down that's it sis this is such an easy technique easiest technique of having box braids not everybody knows how to braid right that's okay so sis i got you like if you don't know how to grip the roots of a braid sis i got you and you know what you're saving money you saving money 2021 my plan is to save as much money as i can and i'm trying to help my sisters out if you don't have to go pay somebody to do it girl sis sister sis sis watch this video pause rewind share it with your friends and while we're here talking about it have you guys subscribed to my channel okay sis subscribe to my channel because i'll be bringing a lot more content you know me okay sis this is the new year new year hair that you were looking for you know that new year's eve either, even though we're not going anywhere you still want to look cute you know maybe it's just you and your family chilling out or whatever or you want to get you want to enter 2021 with a bang okay sis like like me okay so i'm entering 2021 with a bang with my braids okay my jumbo braids they are so light they don't hurt like girl Ooh. okay okay sis okay so that's my last one, the same technique, you know, when I part it in two, you're going to take the expression hair, place it on the middle and use a rubber band to secure it, okay? 
So when you place the rubber band, you know, just make sure you pull it a little bit, give it a tug so it's nice and, you know, a little tight, not too, too tight. Same technique, you take hair from both sides, you add it with your natural hair. The only reason why I add with the middle part, the middle, um, the middle section is because it's right there where the natural hair is. It took me about an hour and a half to complete this look, guys. I was like, yo, like 2021, are you ready? 2021, I'm coming into 2021 with my jumbo box braids like sis, what? Yeah, so it's very, very easy, very beginner friendly. Oh my gosh, like I am very excited about this style, guys. I'm just like, yo, sis, come through. And I'm just going to take my scissors and cut the flyaways, you know. And somebody was asking me if it's okay to put them in hot water. So yes, sis, it's okay. I'm just going to show you guys that today I'll put mine in hot water. But I still have the tiny knots at the end, okay? So that way um, it did not unravel at all. So you, as you guys can see right there, I'm putting them in hot water. Just be careful. Be careful with the water now. And I'm using some mousse just to make sure all the hairs are nice and laid, eh? Okay, so I'm moisturizing my hair. I'm taking uh, my Jamaican black castor oil and mixing it with my coconut oil, moisturizing my scalp. Make sure you moisturize your scalp, sis, because you don't want to be itching up in the streets. And your hair needs moisture too. So, because you know this is a protective style, so that's it. I'm just massaging my scalp, as you guys can see. And I'm taking the um, Eco Styling Gel and I'm just going to do my edges. As I told you, I parted my hair in the front because I just wanted a little bit of the baby hairs. So I am just adding the Eco Styling Gel, but you guys can use any type of hold me down or whatever. I just feel like the Eco Styling Gel works okay for me. That's about it. Okay, sis. Look how clean and nice these are, guys. Oh my gosh, I was so impressed on how this came out. And you know, I can be this accessorizing queen if I don't accessorize, right? I got this from Amazon. I'll put the link in the description below. These are the large um, accessories and voila, magic, honey. Yes, they took this style from zero all the way to whoop, a hundred. Okay. Oh my gosh, I am so happy how this came through. Look at the length. This is the length. They come all the way to my waist and I am in love, honey. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Please subscribe to your girl. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.